היינו רואים אם הוא נחשף לדבר הטוב. If he has כיסופים לדבר הטוב, נעשה מהכיסופים נפש שלושה, from the כיסופים turns into be a נפש שלושה, ונעשים נקודות, נקודות, מבחינת, שלום עליכם, נעשים נקודות, 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 מבחינת נקודות הכסף, ואז הם הצטיירו האותיות שהיו כגולם, ונעשים כלי לקבל טוב, and after when you, בדיוק today I speak about it, זה מטורף, and when you have כיסופים, yeah נעשה כיסופים לנפש שלושה, and then you start working on your נפש, כזה אין, 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 And we took what I took today, I came inside the Machshava, you know, of Rabbeinu, of Rabbeinu. וכאילו לקבל טוב, וכן להפך, חס ושלום. וכן להפך, הוא אומר שלהפך, להפך מינס, אבל אם אתה לא, אתה לא חייב, כמו שאתה אומר, נחשף לדבר הטוב, אתה לא חייב, אז 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 אתה לא חייב, ואחר כך אתה יכול לקבל כלי, לקבל, אתה יכול להפוך להיות כלי לקבל טוב, אז זה כן להפך, עשו להפך. זה כן להפך, חס ושלום. אם נחשף לרע, אם נחשף לרע חס ושלום, נעשים מהכיסופים נפשות שהם מבחינת נקודות. אתה נחשף לרע, אז נעשים מהכיסופים נפשות שהם מבחינת נקודות, ונצטיירו האותיות, ונעשים כלי לקבל רע, and then you are clean to קבל רע. אני נפש אז לא קלין, אני לא כתב איסינג במקום לא טוב, אני לא כתב איסינג אינו גוד ווי, איסינג שלילי, אתה בדיכאון, אתה דפרס, אתה אנגרי, אתה יש לך מידות רעות. אני רוצה להגיע למה שאנחנו מדברים עכשיו, אנחנו מדברים על דבר מאוד חשוב. דה, אז כשאני אומר דה, זה מתחיל לך את הצילוס, רבי נחמן, בן פייגר נחמן בן סמטון, זכוי סייר גלנים, אנחנו עם הסאדק. מי שהוא עושה במעשה מוסר באמונה, who that does business or anything you're doing, you're out being a soldier, anything you do with a minute, beautiful. He does good to his friend, that in his root. On a root level, you're doing good for your friend. When my spear good to all the sivuv, every sivuv, everything around it. And your friend's, his mind gets new mochim. He gets new musagim, new understandings. In the merit of that you're doing your everything with a muna, with your business, all the ups and downs, you're doing everything with a muna. Zed the kari kri ki mishu ba orad. That's from the Azor, I think. As I told below, says chadish siklo betoch a muna. Vilo mochin chadoshim the limit the vekas aboy. And he renews his own intellect. That's one of the important things to constantly be nachmed all the time, renewing your intellect. Chadesh, chadesh. Don't go off old stories. New, 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 new in, in your new understandings. New, new mochid. In order to what? To learn how to be davik to Hashem. That's the whole what we're here for. To be to be constantly with Hashem. Lo kori le savta lachaveo hanishu osa tova lachaveo shemishorasho. And then he's doing good to his friend and his root. So you, you weren't Zohar to be in a shul and this and that. But you just still heard the Tukiyas of Rosh Hashanah. You Rosh Hashanah Shein Sheina Kiddur. Bechinah Masa Matam Ba'amuna. Yeah, remember, Rabbi Nachman's beginning is Rosh Hashanah. Yeah. So it's awakening a new mochin, new moich, new understanding. It's Bechinah Sheina Kiddur. Yeah. And who Bechinah Masa Matam Ba'amuna, Bechinah Pashta Araisa. Learning Torah simply. It doesn't have to be a big chacham and know all the shas. Just simple Not learning, clear and clear, clear. Also to know how to do business properly. We do this one, I spoke about this one of today. I spoke to some about this one, you understand? What the Yitzhara wants from you, the Yitzhara wants from you, or, or everything or nothing, you understand? You smoked a cigarette on Shabbat, so your whole Shabbat went to the Pacha, or Mechalek Shabbat, so your Shabbat went to the Pacha. But if you look at it differently, and you say, I smoked a cigarette, Five minutes of the whole Shabbat, I have a whole Shabbat, another hundreds of minutes to keep Shabbat. You understand what I mean? So it's not on or everything or nothing. It's not on kids only. It's in zone, in zone, be in the middle, you understand? No, but it's also Hashem's constantly creating this minute. 
So you're oh, Davik to Hashem this minute. Even on a Sadiq, even a normal, you see these from Jews all around, around. They have minutes where they're not Davik to Hashem. Where they, yeah. on their level, they're smoking a cigarette on Shabbat. Yeah. Where they're thinking about Znus or they're, they, they're not thinking good about another Jew. Yeah. That's for them, on their level, that's where they're holding. That's them not Davik yeah. to Hashem. When you're Davik to Hashem, you're thinking good about Kaito. Yeah. And you're speaking good about Kaito. And yeah. you're not thinking about Znus. You're thinking about yeah. Zivug Bekadusha. Like, yeah. 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 It wakes you up. Because you knew more upon him, and that's the light of him. Yeah, and look, in your zochir, you know, you feel like just from having this little chafish, you get a renewal in your light, in your face, and he connects it into the tefillin as well. Though. So it's all connected what you just did, putting tefillin on, and it brings new mochin. New everything you're doing, it brings new mochin. New mochin brings simcha. And Rosh Hashanah is and and Yiddishkeit, but tonight's Rosh Chodesh Cheshvan. It's all about renewing. A new month, a new zman. Never let the get become old. Always fresh, always fresh. Thank you very much for being And have keep having a kasuf kasufim. Kasufim is a big zach. Thank you, Hashem. One time you were here, and another time you were somewhere else. Every minute's good. So that's what we're holding. Yes, yeah, so the business activity needs to be done with a muna. As I read, teaches all souls are rooted in the soul of the sadik, with the sadik being like the trunk of a large tree, and all this follows different branch trees. This is the reason certain souls gravitate to one sadik. Let's go to it explains why people go to certain people, not to others. The souls are from the same tree; they share the same root, and so become friends. So this is one of the important things: being with, together with other souls. A friend who is from his root. It translates in our text when you punish a child. So we've been talking about sleep. You punish him with shule. So that's the idea of waking him up. It's the wake of his friend. For his honesty, it brings an illumination of the aura upon him to those close to him. Eventually, this will have a positive effect on him as well to be drawn to Hachma, to return to his root and repent. And Shofar was because this whole teaching was on Rosh Hashanah from Rabbi Nachman in 1801, 5562. He's now connecting the whole thing of renewal of Mochin into Rosh Hashanah. That's what we were just learning now. In Rosh Hashanah, Adam Arishan was put to sleep in order to create Chava. Yeah. Well, True love is beyond this world. Awakening from our sleep. So you don't waste your life in pursuit of heaven of him. And that's what we're going to get to. We started off this Torah, Asha Am Yadeh Trua. It was, remember, this Torah is from Rosh Hashanah, so this is the passage we say before we blow the shofar. Salas Acharase Sumane Hakatoris, Shabbatoch Achum, Arts of Shokhanim, Sumu Amasa Matamamana, Chabim Elav, and it's so says there. Yudai Trua, Yudai Loshin is Chapulis, Trua Meloshin Shvira, Kinitos is Haim is Shvira is Kalim. Bo Penech Yalechin, Bechin is Masa Matam. And he goes on to say that you should know that true indicates breaking because the sparks from the shattering of the vessels. So that's one of the important things we have to realize. We're gathering sparks through the shofar blast, through the voda. We should go in the light of Hashem. We're talking about today in the Halakhashir. The idea in the office, learning in a weekly in the office, all the different shvatim. So Zvulin's voda was to go out and do Masa Matan, and to do it with Simcha, Simcha, on their journeys when they went out. We've been learning this concept. We need every morning. And we learned already this concept of elevation of the 11 spices of the incense. And that is the completion of the Torah of Lamed Hay. Sorry I didn't mention in the beginning because we jumped into a different Torah and Torah 12 in the 12th Torah and we ended up finishing off the 35th Torah. And we'll be learning Kisidron.
in order from Aleph for Bukit tomorrow. I'm already by the 35th Torah, and now we're starting the 36th. Hopefully, next time we learn. Um, there was someone else who was going to come and learn, but he sort of disappeared. So I think I'm just going to keep saying over a little bit some of the summaries over here. Um, Okay, let's see what it says underneath. Sparks are from the shattering of the vessels. As explained, with the shattering of the vessels, vessels, extraneous elements give rise to clippers, which are sparks of holiness, which has become trapped. Now, really explains these clippers from the shattered vessels brought evil into the world to balance the good and to allow man's free will. Thus, knows the shofar bus, means join, gather up, and elevate those broken souls who have fallen into the realm of the clippers. Yeah. So what are we going to do? What's, what are we doing with those sparks? So it's here they shall go, just as the tribe union first. So when they go out to do their business, they're gathering the sparks. That's that's the concept. Now we see, we just had Minka, we said the Katoiris, we're gathering sparks. We have to realize, like again and again, whenever we go out, like Mr. Shem, go to England, Bezrat Hashem, from the 19th till the 1st of December, 19th of November till the 1st of December. And it's an opportunity to gather sparks every time we go there. The way the Balatonia gives a marshal is you're like a sphere running through the valley. Your feet never really touch the ground. That's the way. I'm in between two Shabbos. It's two big mountains of Kedusha, of Shabbos, uh, Pasha's Chaisar and Pasha's Toldus. Those two Shabbos. And they, uh, back in Eretz as well, will be before with the uh, Parshas of Amavinu and then returning with the Parshas of Yaakovinu. In the middle, we're doing them with Yitzhak Savoda and now we're in Yitzhak and told us is already heading into Yaakov. So the idea that they we've got the three of us we're going back to Chesayat with and those big mountains, the Harem, Esayinai the Harem, are giving us the car to run through the valleys to pick up the sparks without touching the ground, like the Sri, the deer. It never really touches the ground. So just like the Tum we are saying to feel us by doing a voda, by learning, we have the ability to refine all the sparks and to get renewal in our voda, in our mochin. And this is how we do business. We do business with a munah. Rabbi Menasech, great Amunah, abundant Amunah, and it's Amunah in us, Hashem is Amunah, He believes in us to do this Avoda, to renew ourselves and to shine light, just like the soldiers out there in battle, my son was just saying, he he started off, he was very excited to hear some Torah and uh, be in the shul, the idea that the Mokin and the Tefillin, it was so to Mishadish in the Avoda, of being a soldier of Hashem, Be'emes, elevating the sparks out there in Gaza, in Lebanon, and wherever he goes when he's back in Eretz HaKodesh. As a voter of elevating sparks, we have to realize these sparks all need to be lifted through a voda, through a voda, through Master Matamba Amuna. And that, that was one of the big. And the awe of Hashem will guide us, will give us the clarity. That's the Asha Am, one of the most powerful moments. Asha Am, Adai Yeshua, Hashem Bo Panech Yadaychu. Yeah, the knowing of the true, how to lift up those sparks from the Shreya Sakelim and to go in the path of Hashem. Masa Mata, like Zvulin. To do everything with Amuna. That's the way. This Pasuk has the awe. And Rabbi Nachman is explaining this deeply. The deepest way. Hiddish Amokhin. Let's see if in the Hebrew edition there's any. No, it goes straight into Torah Vav. So, Bukh Shem. On, on, on par to, to go weiter and look at Maran. Lamed Vav is very good because we're getting ready for Lamed Vav Neris of Hanukkah. Tonight's Rosh Chodesh Cheshvan. I already did a little bit of a Torah from Nei Sotka about Chodesh Cheshvan. Everyone should be blessed with a licht of Cheshavas. We should have the car that we've come out of the Chagim to be able to do our business with Amuna, Simcha, to dance with Mashiach Sakeno. And to not allow ourselves to get old in anything we're doing. So the Simcha for my son being in the base Midrash to renew our Yiddish guy constantly. Doesn't matter where we are what we're having to deal with, you know, he's in the midst of a Bukach Nefesh and he's, Hashem is protecting him and it should be Mechazuk and yeah, what he is doing, what he is able to do, the ultimate service 
מסירס נפש, זה שמע ישראל שם אלכן לשם אחד, זה כפי מסירס נפש, ושם ויחד. שתן קשה, we get these opportunities and we should bring it with us, it's all, wherever we go. דאנס משיח, זה כאילו, מאי ומאי ומאי ומאי.